made it. We're here. Yeah, but we don't know where here is. Tower? Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, uh, I uh, found the Colossus. The trip down memory lane is nice and all, but how do we find the primary terminal thingy? There is so much stuff in here. Yeah, kind of hard to make sense of it all. The old fashioned way, looking around with our eyes. We have to find something that can help guide us. What about... Support protocol initiated! It's him! Oh, it's just more of his stupid recordings. You've selected support protocol. Oh, it's like an automatic assistant or something. Welcome to Terminal Space. Well, shall we? So, wait. He has this whole assistant thing set up, but only he ever comes here? The automated personal assistant system was developed to aid the mighty admin in menial tasks and help his friends navigate the terminal space. Man, so when he first made all this, he was still hoping his friends would come here, too. Kind of makes me feel bad for him, actually. Nobody ever said it was easy to hang on to your... Is that... to begin a new program. I... That was all over my head. Password, password, password. That must be the word of passage. Hashtag potato 451. It's empty? Waiting for material request. I mean, it must be talking about the potato, right? Sounds right to me. Uh, potato, please? Acquiring potatoes. Items dispensed. Thank you. Wait, two potatoes? Yeah, a normal one and a poisoned one. Which one do we use? I mean, the word of passage didn't say anything about poison, but it did have that weird hashtag thingy. That might mean something? Oh, I don't think that symbol ever actually means anything. Hmm. Gotta figure out which one is correct. I hope this is right. I still need to enter the rest of the word of passage. I don't know if this is right or not till I do. Hmm, don't think that's exactly right. Huh, what is this thing? And what does it have to do with Potato 451? Sounds like progress, right? Parrot party protocol initiated. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm guessing that's not quite right. Agreed. Sorry, parrots.
Was that a good thud or a bad thud? It's Fred? Zara, hi. If you're seeing this recording, well, I guess the worst has happened. And you just put the word of passage into the primary terminal. I wish the terminal could just take away Romeo's admin powers. It'd be easier that way. But making this gauntlet was the best I could do. Put your hand into the pedestal to receive the gauntlet. It's got the power to make Romeo normal again. It might take a few hits to remove his powers entirely, but it'll get the job done. Do you understand? Then good luck, Sara. You're... Well, I think you might need it. Well, here goes nothing. What do you think you're doing? What's happening? We're here to stop you, Romeo, once and for all. I told you, your world's done! No take backs! Jesse, hurry! Jesse, remember when we first met? Oh, that was back when I thought we could still be friends. Huh. This temple, this challenge, is my first gift to you. Now, it's going to be where I bury you. Platform, Jesse. Ah. Nowhere to run. Ah. Unbelievable. I can still use the gauntlet. Just die already.
and give it up. Oh, I am going to... Uh, you... Don't... Don't touch me! Touch me! Touch me. Oh, Jesse. Petra? <laughs> Aren't you happy to see me? Our friendship's gotten a little lucky on this adventure, hasn't it? Little worn thing. I wonder who did that. I'm not listening to you, admin. No? That's a shame. Here I thought it would be a nice way of working through some things. It's who you are, how you act. Don't you judge me! You don't get to judge me! Give me that! Oh. That's, that, that's the cause of all this! Let go! make everything so difficult. Everyone likes you. And you're nothing. Hey, we're not the ones trying to rule the world. What? No, no, I'm not. I just... I just wanted people to... People to... Place 
place is held together by my powers. No more powers. No more terminal zone. <laughs> We're doomed. We're gonna get buried if we don't get out of here pronto. What about him? What about him? He's not our problem anymore. But look at him. He'll never make it out of here on his own. Oh, she's right. Just... just leave me. My power... It was just frosting on a, on a cake. An empty, worthless cake. No, this is where I belong. This is where I'll pay for what I've done. I can't believe that, that this is what it took for me to realize. Oh, I've been just so stupid, so blind. You can still fix things, Romeo. No matter what you've done, you're still a person. Like everyone else, you can be redeemed. Redeemed? You... You really believe that, don't you? Jesse, now's the time. We gotta go. Go on, leave me. I deserve to stay in this oblivion. You're not staying here. That would be the coward's way out. Come on. If the lava gets to that portal before we do, we'll be stuck here forever. Then let's move. Not a minute too soon. Oh my gosh! It's not to following me, right? Right? Nah, I think you're in the clear, Slim. Hey, nice work. Sincerely, I hardly believe that I deserve to be here at all anymore. I do know what I need to do to make up for my crimes, though. I'm going to return to the underneath. Try to help all the people I left behind. Fix all the lives I... ruined. And I'm going to try and find Zara. See if I can't make things right between us. I mean, it doesn't make up for what I... Or what I did to Fred. But if I can heal things with Zara, well, it's something at least. And, and no more admin powers. Everything I do now will just be the normal way. 
I think you might want to stay away from her, Romeo. I honestly think she might just kill you if she sees you again. Well, then that's a risk I have to take. She's sort of the only friend I have left. <sighs> Seems fitting that my only friend wants to kill me. Save the world again, huh? Doesn't that ever get old? Why, yes, thank you for noticing. Thought we'd fit in a light bit of world saving before afternoon pie time. Happy to see you all in one piece, too. Whoa, 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 whoa! Is that the admin? Is he- Don't worry. He's not the admin anymore. This is Romeo. Well, that's a relief. No more admins for me, thank you very much. I agree with that 112%, Blondie. But Jesse, after everything he did, do you- you really think he deserves to go free? What if he hurts more people? He might... He might have been better off where he was. Doesn't have his admin powers anymore. Now, he's just Romeo. He's harmless. Yeah, I'd worry more about people wanting to hurt him. A lot of people out there who might want a piece of the old admin. What do you guys say we head home? I say, way ahead of you, friend. <laughs> Me too. Man, I cannot wait to put on a shirt again. Approaching you from this direction and am coming to speak with you. No ninja trickery, hijinks, or tomfoolery here. Yeah, I mean, I mean, you're right there. I can see you. I know, I know, but I'm trying not to sneak up on people anymore. So, no more ninja Ivor then? Ha! Huh. No, no. I decided it was time to stop running around in my pajamas and start trying to fix a few messes. Starting with trying to heal the rift between my old friends. Ellie will be easy. Just need to stop by Redstonia. Last I heard, Gabriel was doing the wandering warrior thing. Yeah, take it from me. It might be awkward, but I swear it'll be worth it. Good to know. It won't be the first time I've created an awkward situation. <laughs> well, I suppose it's time for me to go. This has been fun, though, hasn't it? Jesse! Jesse, hey! What's up, Radar? I was just saying goodbye to... Guess ninja habits die hard. I, uh, hope you don't mind, but uh, I've kind of been taking charge of the beautification project. I thought, why not at least make it look intentional? Really stepping it up to leader mode, if I do say so myself. And it's been stressful, but also fun. You've definitely been stepping it up. I'm really proud of you. Oh, wow. This is best day. Whoa! Hey, Luna. Anyway, uh, so with Champion City gone, I was going to make Luna a new llama house and get her set up here in Beacon Town while I help out up there. But uh, before I did, I thought I'd uh, double check and see if you'd already been planning on, you know, uh, watching out for her. Seeing, you know, that she likes you so much and all. If you've already built her a llama house when I haven't been around, I, I just wouldn't want to double up. And if she wants to stick with me, it'll be my honor to keep taking care of her. I think she'll really like that. I may not have appreciated you before, but I'm coming around. I'm excited for us to spend more quality time together. Okay. Well, the stupid emotions. I do want to sincerely thank you, Jesse, for everything. You 
time saw me at my worst, and you still thought I was worth saving. That, well, that makes me want to try to be better at being my best. Hoping I can start by helping clean up this dump. Yeah, what can I say? I looked below the surface and saw that you probably weren't the worst all the way down. What was that about Stella being the worst? Ha! <laughs> hey! I was just telling Stella here that I would take care of Luna for her. Oh, cool. Well, she seems very excited. Yes, and now I must go. Thank you again for everything. Sincerely. Now, you got everything you need, all packed and double-checked? Yes, Jack. This is very, I don't know, bittersweet for me, you know. Um, goodbyes are no good. Hey. Hmm. That we have, Nermi, so I won't say it this time. <laughs> Not to people that I will see again. <laughs> you got it. Come on, walk me to the gate. So, you're leaving, apparently? For how long? Honestly, probably a while. But it's good this time. I'm doing it for me. I'm trying to, like, grow or whatever. Anyway, I'm about to say goodbye to everyone, and I... Ah! Come here. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Promise oh, broken. Oh, jeez. It'll be okay. So Petra's heading off into the great unknown, huh? <laughs> I figured. Definitely sounds exciting. You could start a new town, find temples or dungeons or whatever you hack and slash types do. Everyone's got to find their happy place. For Petra, it's mostly in unexplored forests and caves. Yeah. I think I'm closing that chapter of my life for a while. It's time to settle down. Here. Hey, you guys are missing out on prime group hug action. Ah, no air! Actually dying! Ah. <sighs> you don't think this is like the last time we'll all be together, do you? No. Well, maybe. I don't know. I mean, if Petra's leaving... Even if it is, no matter what, will always be best friends. And I know that you'll all be the best friends I ever had. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm going to get out of here before I... <laughs> too late. Bye, guys. Be safe out there, okay? The safest. And when you finish that book of yours, I better have a great part in it. Uh-huh. <laughs> Back in the admin's cabin, I, I know you promised that we'd always stick together. But the invite's still open if you want it. No pressure. Wait, you're leaving? Yeah, I think Petra and I are gonna hit the road for a while. <gasps> Sounds pretty awesome, right? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I mean, it does, but but without you here, who will run Beacon Town? Things are peaceful now, but danger could still strike at any time. Who do you think, pal? You! Me? Really? Yeah, I hereby promote you from intern to hero in residence. Thanks, boss. This, uh, you have been, you are. What I'm trying to say is that I promise I'll make you proud. You already have. Everyone's going to miss you, you know? And I'm going to miss them, too. But if anyone ever really needs me, I'll be around. Bye, everyone.
everyone. Hey, dummy, you gonna wait up or what? you'd be interested in a race? Ha! You're on! 